League game. Is this Chognar, and if not, why not? Yeah, not. They could do a Chognar side lane, but they probably need to. They probably would play like a like potentially. Uh, they need to pick a mage here. Uh, Chognar mid would not work for them. So I think a Jinnar or someone that can engage did it really once. high. Yeah, it, it could work. Chognar mid could work, but I think a Jinnar would work really well here because you can engage super hard into the enemy team because that's what your comp wants to do. You know, the Pyr wants to go in, the Irie wants to go in, the Malak wants to go in, the Slims wants to stay back. Jinnar would offer that damage reduction he gets when he jumps on the enemy team and casts. Speaking of rotations, Crane may be caught out by one. Momo will be oh, split out wow. as well. Fran goes through. They have the healing and the stun and the kill. Momo is gone. ZRK, though, does land a nice cult, and that'll be all. Very bad for And they get me. so much damage. Cray, he stays too long. He's gone, the Jinnar. Abyssal Dragon up for grabs. Maxi will go in with the shot. Cray split badly from the rest of the team, and already White's been rushed in the back lines, but he takes him out with the aid of Maxi. That is a massive kill. Cray and ZRK are desperately trying to get a response onto Fran, but they've been unable to do so. Now, finally, they find the trade, and I believe Taiku just took the Abyssal in favor of Pain Gaming. Down bottom, they will lose so many players, particularly as 0-8 wow. comes through. That's a very good spin. ZRK finds a stop. The Cole will get another trade, and Taiku comes through, making it an even fight. That Valheim's going to start scaling to late game. Look at him. He's, he's finished his Blitzblade already, and once Cole. he starts cross cave. ZRK, that was a hard engage. The shock's Whoa. there as a result. He's barely able to flicker to safety, but the tower shot still finds him. Maxine will be caught down the Thief's Mark, but White is unable to be relevant to the vast majority of this fight, and Momo is so low. He has to retreat too. Pain Gaming get very little. Here's this Abyssal Dragon. Assassin's crew are going for it, but the flank's already here. ZRK uses the call around the side, and this is a slaughter. Pain Gaming absolutely deletes Assassin's crew, but he can't do nothing. Zero Eight is desperately attempting a recall, but the oh, Thief's no. Mark detonates. He's staying here for good. Pain Gaming demolish their opponents, oh and that should be game one. That's a full ace there, and that was so unfortunate. They bunched up on top of each other, and basically allowed maximum damage from Pain Gaming to come out here. That's not what you want. Pain Gaming stroll into the base and take it. 1-0, their lead. There's the lock-in. Okay, I think Pain Gaming entirely revolves around how they deal with the crash. Everything revolves around whether or not they're able to get past the front line. I really love Assassin's Creed Composition. This is what they excelled on from last game. The f what do they do during the opening? Well, right now they're having to receive a lot of pressure from Pain Gaming, an early engage from both sides. And already Cray finds value. Ooh. Maxi needs to back out though, because that was major play from Momo. That blinding light finding so much value, and Buddy stunned out. Excellently done by Pain. That was so bad for Assassin's Crew there. That spin combo was oh. just devastating there. Landed on three members, and you can see why you bunch up against an Irie, and it's not a good look, Philly. So. Oh, Pain Gaming are watching this. Ooh. They see it coming, and they're ready to steal the Abyssal Dragon, but the Metamorphosis oh, comes through, no. and White, White is isolated, but it doesn't matter, Maxi needs to fall back because of Kray's pressure into the back lines. That is devastating. Assassin's Crew lose everything. ZRK sweeps through alongside Kray, and it's six kills to one in the feed. Kray, get stunned down. No, oh, no, the Feast Mark was a little too late there. Oh, there's another good Thief Smart coming through, but Fran's in a lot of trouble. The tower aggroed on him. He will not quite go down. The being a bro is already spent, though, oh. which means there is nothing to stop this. As the combo comes through, Momo only gets one, but that's enough. The 0 8 so low, he's just going to have to retreat, ceding complete map control to Pain Gaming. Value. Oh my god. Oh, that's good. The flicker right on in. ZRK. He spent so oh, much and Craze there to god. follow up. Dark Dominion for a double kill. Mana Freeze will reverse one, but not two with his own resurrection. Now that. Oh, good damage comes through for the Ricky shot, but the shield. Mana Freeze survives. Vaccines, Metamorphosis, wow. chains down Bobo, and he will fall underneath the tower. And there's another tower to be picked up. Zero Eight will go in, but I don't think he has the life steal to win this. Not even Kilgroth as Buddy flickers in response. Ooh. He'll find major damage. One kill found, but the exuberance doesn't have enough. 
Oh my CRK, goodness. that's quite good. He will get one, but it's just a trade. The thing that matters, though, is that trade is beneficial to Assassin's crew. And the rest oh, nearby, but the flank comes that. in. Maxine with the metamorphosis. That is a major engage. The march in the backlight will slow it start. down. Maxine is all alone. There's no backup. By the time the rest of the team comes through, the damage may have already been done because Buddy's overcommitted. Oh. He's going to be Dark Dominion jolted in, and Maxine gets nothing. Oh, Being God. a bro was active, but Mana Freeze falls for a second time. Time, just as the Drake is summoned in mid lane, that is devastating for what Assassin's Crew. What are Crew. they doing? Work together. You have the crush landing a beautiful metamorphosis and jumping onto the Slim's back line, onto White. But there's no support, there's no follow up. You guys are playing one at one. This is like a solo queue match instead of a team match. Maxine for a desperate last stand will go down 0 8. We'll avoid the taunt, but that's all as Fran comes through. Assassin's crew lose game two.